Good day. Day one in the Maldives. I'm James. And I'm Ellie. And welcome to our first Maldives vlog. <laughs> we came in last year. We're on a different island today. You and me cocoon. Last year we went to Karudu. This is a much smaller island than Karudu. Takes 10 minutes to walk around, whereas Karudu took like an hour. Yeah. Or something. So very, so, very small. As you can see behind Ellie, we have well, it's still very nice even though it's raining. You can see that rain cloud over there literally just come past us a few minutes ago. But it's still very gorgeous. Okay, so our room type uh, we've got here at You and Me Cocoon is the Aqua Suite. Um, it's a sunrise facing room. Um, so yeah, as you can see, obviously it's a water filler. Very different to the last one. Very, very different. We had a beach filler last time. So it's nice, it's nice to try something different. So when we arrived, we were given a key for yeah. our room. Very different as well. A very different. Yeah, isn't it? Very, but very yeah, as you can different. see, we've got this is a view. Yeah. You can see some fish at night, apparently. Yeah. We've seen a Titan trigger fish so far. And a puffer fish. The, the water's very... <laughs> this shit. So as you can see, to the left of our room, if you're coming out, we've only got four that side. And then we have five the other side of us. So there's only a select few of these villas. Yeah. And Ellie, do you want to do the honours? We'll show you our Acra Suite room which we were very, very, very surprised how nice it was. So we're in Suite 206. So as you come into the room, you've got a luggage rack. We have already unpacked, so obviously our luggage is on there. Um, and then you're greeted with these very, very large wardrobes. They are loads of space. magnificent, yeah. Tons of room, got three drawers. You've obviously got stuff. your safe. Um, you are actually given two life jackets, which we've actually bought our own for James, but we didn't need to. It's In true. the wardrobe, you're given two umbrellas, two raincoats, and a beach bag. Oh yeah, show this them the beach, beach bag. bag. Our uh, host told me I can take home with me. That is exactly what I will be doing. So each room category has their own host. Um, you are given his WhatsApp number and you can WhatsApp him. So if we wanted to book dinner at a restaurant or a trip, we'll just WhatsApp and go, oi, book this for us. Not literally oi. <laughs> no. but so our host um, is Shanaz. He's lovely, isn't he? Yeah, he is. Really, really. He's only been here a month, bless him, because he lost his job at the Shangri-La because it closed because of COVID still. Some resorts are still not open in the Maldives. You wouldn't think like nearly. No. 18, 19 months on the pandemic. No, so um, our host showed us around our room and said that I can obviously use the speech bag and I can take yeah. home with me. So how cool is that? You come in, you've got. Um, we'll start over with the vanity area here. We've got obviously, as you can see, vanity area where you've got a room directory and an in-bar villa. It tells you the prices of your mini bar, snacks, and stuff like that. Um, then you've got snacks. Um, so all of these snacks here are chargeable. Apart from tea and coffee. Tea, and coffee, included. water um, included. is included. We got given a bottle of wine and we did have some chocolates on there, but they're gone. I mean, if anyone saw a crudo videos, right? They left the champagne and I didn't eat drink away from oh, South African wine as well. Oh, well, it's different. Might have to try that. Game I didn't time. eat. I don't, I, you don't, don't eat wine, eat you drink wine. Not very much an alcohol lover apart from a couple it. of things, but I suppose we, it's South African, we'll give it a go. It'll probably, it'll probably result in James pulling a funny face. Yeah, it will, it will, it will. So anyway, so, on with this, um, you've got a, a Lavazza coffee machine and a kettle obviously yeah. to make tea. And then we've got this cupboard um, with your glassware. So you've got your tea, coffee cups, wine glasses, champagne glasses and tumblers. Then you've got the mini bar with the wine cooler. Chocolates are obviously not included and thought, look, teasing us with lint, lint. milk chocolate, I mean. And Toblerone, I mean, what? Yeah, so we've got all the juices and soft drinks are free. Yep, and these bottles of water. So the you and yeah. me bottles of water. Yeah, they're, they're all free. They're included with the all-inclusive plan. Yeah, so that's that. Because we haven't told you yet, we're on all-inclusive. So yeah, you get those included. You just don't get the alcohol, so the spirits and the beer. You don't but, get that. but we do get alcohol oh, out yeah, and about on the island. You don't get that in your mini bar. So then you've got this lovely large bed. You've got a ceiling fan. Nice high pitch. We have got an AC unit as well. The one big difference with this room is it doesn't have a mosquito net. Now there's already been a few mosquitoes in our room, so that's going to be interesting. And you've got two bedside tables with lamps either side, and then you've got this seating area, which is really nice. TV. Um, you get given. The beach towels, but you only need to use those out on the balcony. You don't need to take these towels with you or water. 
you can get the milk to on the island. Well, we're gonna take you out there in a bit. We're gonna take you in the bathroom, so come, 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 come. This is really nice. First we'll come over here. Okay, so here we have a lovely bath. Not like the one I ground in in Dubai. It's um, supposed to be quite echoey in here. But if you haven't seen any of them vlogs, they'll be out and about. They'll be, it'll be like at the end of the video in here if you want to watch it. This bath has got head pillows as well. It's a couple's bath. Is it? <laughs> Interesting, I love that one. And then we've got lovely rain head shower. As you can see to the right of us, we have, if you want privacy, there's, you know, there's blinds either side. And where the decks are quite higher than the water, people are swimming, you don't really have to worry about privacy that much unless you can stand up and start going freaking like this around. You've also got your towel rack. So let's say when you don't need new towels, you just pop them on the floor. Or in the basket. But this is really nice, yeah, or in the bar, probably the basket because it keeps it neater in here. And you've got this lovely sink area, lovely big mirror, very sinks are nice, and then you've got, got the shaving amenity kits and a wine scale, which is probably not going to come out because who weighs herself on holiday? And then we have a bidet and your normal toilet. I mean, we didn't use a bidet in Dubai, so I don't think we're going to be using it here. As you can see, we've done the whole inside of the room, which is really, really nice. So this is our balcony, this is all ours. So we've got a seating area if we wanted to sit here and maybe upload some footage at the end of the day. Watch sunset out here. Yep, sun, sunrise. Sunrise. We've got our own private little space for- Let me just take you down there. The water down here. I'll try not to fall in. So yeah, you can access the water here. Apparently there's, there's uh, a strong current around here, so I'm already on edge about trying to get into the water, but. Oh, that's a cool feature. So we've got a shower. Don't you dare spray that at me. Go on, press it. So when you come out the sea, you can show yourself off. There you go, that's new. We didn't even know that was here a minute ago, did we? And then once you've been in the water, you've got your washing line over here in the corner. Oh, that's good. And then we've got our two little sunbeds with a uh, bit to put our drinks on. Towels are obviously in there to lay on here. This is just for the deck only. One thing to note as well, you've got shampoo, hair conditioner, and shower gel. Yeah, so you don't have to bring anything. That's our room tour. So we haven't eaten, so since we've been here, it's 20 past one. You and me cocoons is one hour ahead of Marley time. So we're six hours ahead of- UK time. UK time. And then we're just gonna go and get something to eat and probably show you some about lunch in a minute, aren't we? Because I am Hank Marvin at the minute. So we're gonna go and then probably have a little swim after lunch. We sit down at a restaurant, it's called The Sandbar, but I'm guessing. the green carpet. Yeah. But because the weather's a little bit naff today, they, whenever the weather's a little bit naff, they serve it at the sand. So this restaurant is like, it's all undercover under wooden kind of, I can't really explain it. There's a fish tank in the middle. This, this, is, the main, yeah, this is the main restaurant where you'd come and have breakfast every day. Yeah, I feel quite sad because there's lobsters in that tank. And I know if someone orders them, they're going to get cooked alive. Probable. Thing is, lobster toast is quite nice. Yeah, I know it does. Mm -hmm. um, and this little fish tank, they've got like little Titan trigger fish. I love those. They've got some like little grouper in there or something. And oh, yeah, yeah, loads of little random yeah. random fish. But uh, we're just hoping the sun will come out today. So, yeah. Pretty crap, innit? At the minute. But like, this restaurant's nice. We just ordered our food. I've gone for like a club sandwich without the meat because we're vegetarian, well, pescatarians. And then a bruschetta, and Ellie's gone for like veggie noodles. So we'll show you that when they come out. Let's test out what the water's like while we're down here. Oh, coral. Yeah, Bastards. Oh, ow. <laughs> oh, kind of warm. Yeah, they're all fish. That's all fish. Very nice. Cold. So we had a, we had our all cross. Yeah, we've had our lunch. I had a bruschetta That's with a garlic bread as a starter, and then I had a club sandwich without a chicken in. Without chicken. Just asked it, and then you had. Um, I had the veggie noodles, which was delicious, and then after we had some ice cream. Oh yeah, chocolate and vanilla. Ellie had all three flavours, yeah. which is really nice. And we're just exploring now. We're just yeah. having a little walk around the island. It only takes 10 minutes to walk around, so it's not going to take us ages. No, and I've just noticed this thing here. <clears throat> so you can have, it's, I think it's called the love boat. 
So you, love... can pay, you can book and pay to have dinner or lunch or whatever on there. Okay. That's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. So, whoa. I wonder cool. if they have, they must have low and high tides here because look, sure. look at the bank behind us. Yeah. I think we're going to have a little walk around now and then we're probably going to go for a little swim a little later. I don't know. No? It's a bit cold, isn't it? Okay, yeah, it is a little bit chilly but um, we'll and see. the weather's not that nice but we'll see. We've got the gear on anyway just in case. All the gear and no idea. Yeah. So we'll do some exploring. Found our first hermit crab. Yeah, he's cute, this one. He's a bit shy at first. A bit shy. He's coming out of his show now. Yeah, Get it? <laughs> Hang on, he's on his back. Oh, hey. I don't want him falling. It's okay. Got a little buddy. Cute, that one. By Horatio. Ratio. So these sweets behind us are the aqua sweets but with a pool. Um, I think they've got a sunset view, haven't they? Yeah, they must do because yeah. our, our ones are like the opposite side of this island and we've come across a nice little pink and blue. Yeah, I don't know what it's about, but. Around here? Yeah, look. So I have no idea what it's about. It's cute so, though. I find the sand's probably a little bit bitier here than it was at Karudu yeah. on your feet. Who noticed that? There's certain bits that are really nice and then like this bit we're standing on at the minute. It's like, look all the shells, look. I mean, they don't hurt, hurt. It's just a little bit ouchy. They don't hurt, hurt. A little but, bit ouchy. But um, at least the sun's trying to come out anyway. That's a positive. Yeah, isn't it? it's just got warm all of a sudden. Yeah. So we're just going to have a little walk around, see if we come across anything else. Yeah. If not, we'll catch up with you in a bit. So if you can see some of the fish, you've got some trigger fish, Sergeant Major, and some other fish that we're not sure about. But wayfinding, like, I don't even know wayfinding. I mean, that's it's where we come. Right. Our rooms are like, I think the villas are just over there in the background. The teppanyaki is that hut there. Obviously the pink and blue where we just come from. Um, the sand looks really nice, but it hurts your feet. So we read up, you needed, what'd you call it, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, sea shoes. James didn't want to bring the sea shoes with us. Because I didn't think we need them. So I'm comparing it to Karudu. But, um, God, look at that Sergeant Major down here. F***ing, he's huge. F***ing hell. No. And we're waiting to see a little sharky. So we're just going to go down the end and have a look. And then we'll be back at the room. And then we'll maybe catch up with you later, depending on what we do. Oh, roll over. Yeah. Roll over. <laughs> this is the kind of thing you do in the Maldives. It was concrete. Ain't it? It's a bit lively, this one. Isn't he? Be nice. It's so cute. No, it's got rolling over. So I think we found the best part of the beach around here. Yeah. If you can see the dark bit in the water there, they're all fish. So if I go in the water, I'll show you the fish because they just look like rocks, but they're not rocks, really. We haven't got a gear on or anything yet. We're still exploring. Look, see him? It's really cool. There's tons of them. They stretch. You can see the little line just goes all the way along there. Um, we haven't seen any sharks around yet. The beach is nice, apart from the sand biting your feet. It's really nice. Just got to decide where we're going to go and have a swim first. As you can see, the skies are clearing up. They're clearing up finally. Yeah! Good evening, everyone. So, we've just had a really chilled and relaxed afternoon, haven't we? Yeah, it's a good few hours later. Yeah, so we just spent the afternoon on our deck terrace if that's what you call really it like what you call it um it's just so peaceful so relaxing we both had a little nap we've got a new little friend there's james so we've got a new little friend by the way um i'm just backing up some food we've got a new little friend it's a, a box it's a box fish or a puffer fish i'm not too sure but it's quite big he's about as big as this and he basically just swims down by our little deck down here all day and some parrotfish come off early and he got really territorial and chased them off and then we couldn't find him and he just come back come like he's comes been there back for again. hours isn't he yeah he's cute we called him billy so yeah we i just hope that he's not that territorial when we go in the water but yeah, yeah no like we said we just had a really chilled afternoon we're both absolutely knackered um it's currently half past six we've got dinner in half an hour at the italian a la carte restaurant yeah Having a shower was a bit strange because I felt a little bit vulnerable. Um, <laughs> there is a blind that you can pull down in there, 
but do you know what just went for it if anyone was gonna see me f it <laughs> they would have done so yeah no but i mean yeah this is where we're sat yeah as you can see there's there's the bath and that's the shower and that is the view i mean if you're i don't know if we told you about this earlier but if you're wondering what that is that's the h2o restaurant yeah. the underwater we're restaurant be, we're not going to be doing that while we're here because we ate at the hirawali last year the 5.8 at Karudu, which is like at the, the best underwater restaurant you're ever going to do. So I'm sorry, you and me, but that is not going to compare, and I'm not going to, I'm not going to do it. And you know, I'll be underwhelmed. I think, I think we both will. Yeah. If we do it, so we're not doing it. Yeah. So it's just lovely. The sound of the waves, which I think is what sent us to sleep earlier. But oh. and there's so much activity out here with fish. There was a big group of parrotfish chasing fishies down here earlier, which woke me up from my sleep. That's how loud they were. And yeah, you just see little fishies swimming about all day. And our little friend lives just there. But he must have gone to bed. Oh, we just got a really cute comment off someone on Instagram. They're like, if you're watching this, it's a lady called Sean Dave. She was like, are you gonna be posting your Dubai Maldives? Of course we are. You'll be seeing our videos. So they said they're going for the honeymoon at some point. I didn't read the rest of the comment. Mm, how lovely. Because um, I didn't want this to close down or anything. We're on the oh, well, so you. yeah, we will be putting our videos out to you. And I was a little and bit thank you for your comment. earlier, because we got in, I was like, I don't know if it's because I was tired, because I've had a lot of sleep on and off. And I was like, I don't know if we're gonna be able to vlog every day here, because it's like it's so tiny, but a lot of you like seeing it. Like when we, we watch, we hope other, you do. Yeah, when we watch other people's videos and they do it within 20 minutes for like a whole week or something, you're like, I want to watch more. What are you doing? Why are you depriving us of all this stuff? They're like the travel ones are the best ones, and yeah. So hopefully, we get to see them all. And I'm getting hungry now, so I'm getting um I'm yeah. getting a bit of a baby brain or whatever you call it. So we're gonna go and get some dinner. Um. Not really done much tonight, literally just had a shower and checked to a dress. I'm <laughs> doing that the whole time I'm you've been so doing that. I'm so bloody tired, so yeah. Right, all Can't these are done tonight. for today, so we can... Anyway, yeah. we're going to go for some dinner and we will show you what we've got from the Italian. And there's a shark, there's a black tip shark around here somewhere, they're obviously hunting the fish, it's quite active here at night. Mm. Oh, oh no, look. Oh no! Oh, quick, buddy. Get in the water. <laughs> quick, go! Oh. Quick! You hold that, I can get him in. Quick. There it is. Look, the size of that. Wow! Oh! Oh, look at the Cavalli! Yeah. So yeah, I had the bruschetta for starter, and then for main I had freshly made pasta and had some made pasta. Yeah. Which was lovely, and then for dessert I had profiteroles, and they were chocolate orange profiteroles. Yeah. And they were so good. Yeah. 
<laughs> we, couldn't, we couldn't film any of the dinner because the lighting was so like really really bad. But we found a pool table. They've got a pool table here. It's all look proper American eight ball. And this is no well. it's so competitive, but it's no problem playing. Yeah. So um, I'll tell you that story when we get back to the room a little bit later. I need to put, um, play because this battery's going to die pretty much any second. Well, we thought we'd come in here to tell you that we're done for the day. We booked some two, there's only two trips of booking because there's not a lot to do like we did last year. We're doing a sunset cruise on Monday and then we're doing a half day experience which involves an hour on a ship finding dolphins and then we go on to Tsunami Island which was in it was habited, it was a habited island back in the day now it's inhabited because the tsunami's wiped everything and then yeah. we go over to another island. Picnic or picnic island. island do some snorkeling yeah and i think um, we get like fruit and stuff like that included and drink yeah i don't know we'll find out so sorry just appreciate the lovely room it's gorgeous here so that's it for the end of our day if you made it this far like the video for us if you enjoyed the video like it as well and obviously uh hit subscribe if you want to follow more of our journey and that as well because 80 percent of like 82 percent of you that don't watch our videos are not subscribed so if you do it help us out massively and also leave us a comment yeah we really enjoy it reading your comments yes we do so, so even if it's said, just short isn't it yeah. Even if it's just short, I'm melting here when you get a fan on. <laughs> so, with that being said, thank you so much for watching, yeah. and we will see you next, next week. week. Bye! Bye.